Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99 how you doing? Hey, it's July the 2nd, 2018, and I'm going to ramble a little bit. Uh, for those of you that follow me, you know I'm in my, well, I am 60, and I'm so used to, even though I've been self-employed about a third of my life, a little more than a third. Um, so much of today's society is like working with the boss and kind of whatever the boss says goes, right? And, you know, you might have, over the years, I might have given a suggestion or two to some of my bosses and they really didn't listen to me. And I'm like, well, hey, that's, my, you know, my idea humbly is a, pretty good idea right so maybe you've done that maybe you've gotten shot down or they say hey you know what don't one upsman the boss and just kind of keep a low pri profile do your job and you'll be fine so I was just reminiscing again this morning how and I'm still wrapping my my head around it because I experienced this in a positive way at least once a week the whole concept in the cryptocurrency sphere of decentralization and I'm just going to pick a few examples okay like I remember doing a few interviews with Val at local coin swap and you know we would do the pre-interview and then we would do the interview and in the pre-interview he said crypto matter 99 ask me anything you can ask me anything about the project and I will tell you. I want to be transparent. We want to be upfront. And he said, frankly, one of the first videos I did during the ICO phase, he said, the team at Local Coin Swap really sees the leaders working for the community. And I'm like, what a concept. Leaders that want to empower the community, that listens to the community, and is there not solely for the community, but has an open ear. And I was just on Twitter, and I don't know, there's an ICO coming out, I didn't even really get the name, and somebody made a suggestion, which prompted me to do this video. And, you know, the tweet came back, hey, so-and-so, we've noted your suggestion no we've taken note of your suggestion and we will implement it as soon as we can and i'm like only in the crypto space or in my in my personal experience only in the crypto space can you make a suggestion and you get patted on the back and encouraged to uh, to do more so anyhow um and then i'm thinking about the digibyte awareness team Rudy and Derek again just a week ago 10 days ago I did a video with them and just smart people smart individuals and somebody sent me a, an email at cryptomentor99 at yahoo.com and said hey could you ask the digibyte awareness team I don't know how to use a wallet or what's the best wallet to use and where can I spend digibyte and so I just did you know, a little, I don't know, three, four, five, six minute video, sent it to the Digibyte Awareness team on Twitter, and Rudy got back and said, hey, we're gonna take what you said into consideration and start doing, Rudy didn't use the word tutorial videos, but start listening, or not start listening to the community, but in other words, Crypto Matter 99, we hear what you're saying, and we're gonna move in that direction. And once again, I'm like, this is so unlike, when I was in the marketplace, not self-employed, worked for a boss, and not that my boss was asking for my input frequently because I was in sales, but again, it just always amazes me how in the crypto space, it seems like most of the projects I'm involved with or I'm investing in want to hear from me and they value my, my input. Again, what a concept, right? And I think about Zinfin, I think about 
you know, the Zinfin, X-I-N, F-I-N out of Singapore, their telegram channel, you know, and local coin swap has a great telegram channel too, but with Zinfin, people are so eager to answer your question. I mean, it's just, I don't know, it's just kind of cool to me. And again, I'm an old guy, so the idea that someone, you know, in a decentralized world, right, with the crypto space, cryptocurrencies that, again, they just, the leaders, the advisors value our input, want our input. And I just saw a video, I forget the gentleman's name, he's in Texas, which is in the United States. And he's a new member of the Digibyte Awareness Team. And I'm like, cool. And I think he's like a video guy because he was talking about doing, like, he didn't say tutorials, but videos for Digibyte. And I'm like, again, how cool is that? Everybody brings their talents and energy and time together to build up whatever cryptocurrency that you're, you're invested in or you want to be a cheerleader for. Anyhow, I'm done rambling. Crypto Mentor 99, hopefully I could shut off. I can't even see it's in the sub. But anyhow, love you all. And uh, yeah, thanks for listening. See you later. Bye-bye.